of temptations. I want to build mushroom houses and I want to live um, um, in, in, and I want to call all the rocks rock and all the critters frame. Okay, hi, hello, Jesus, eight minutes and the door crashed. Hopefully that's it for today. Oh, I need to turn those timers off. Window project. Yeah. Hello there. Hi, hello. Really, really need. <sighs> <laughs> yep. You are first. Um, and a treat. Thank you. Need to turn those timers off. Eight minutes and I crashed. I really need to get into the uh, thing and do the graphics card swap. Drink some water. Eat some food. I'm off. Take your meds. I'm off. And be kind to yourself. Yes. You testing all the things. Give oh wait break. oh no i've got to set the sparkle disabled a wonderful idea. <laughs> well okay then <laughs> hi carter okay hello it's all the things all the things are happening okay okay bunny bunny ears are on oh shit Okay, so hopefully that's our crash for the day and we won't have another one. Excellent. Well, now now you've tested all the things. I, I know they work. Um, oh, yeah. Excellent. Um, am I missing anything? Treat. I am going to have a pineapple gummy as my treat. Pineapple gummy. Oh. Quite hanging. Hi, Al. I guess you're in good at double summons. Stupid crash. Hello. Now my phone app isn't working. Okay. Testing. Okay, that's working. Okay. Okay. It looks like everything's working. Um, so assuming we don't crash again, we probably won't, because it only happens once a once a stream. Um Okay, now I've got the timer going for the bunny ears. <laughs> No ah uh. liar I mean I did I did actually when my stream crashed 
I didn't even got out of the... <laughs> Thanks. Between you and Cody, you've got everything tested. Um... <laughs> I, I appreciate it. Uh... Oh, is Dixper working? No, I didn't have to start to restart that. Um, so yeah, plan today is squares, try and finish the cardigan, and then uh, whatever else happens after that. I have to test this again. Oh, pam. That is top. Um, try this one. Okay, that's working. Wow, that covers like half my screen. Okay. So we just get in. We've got five to do. It's five squares to do today. Three pink, two blue. Um. And and then the cardigan. Spent all morning arguing with Amazon about orders and then fucking up. Jerks. But, oh, I need to fix the uh, focus on that. Maybe I have to see my nails better. Bigger. Here, turn that off. That, that, and that. Here. That's better. We are on, I don't know what the playlist is, I can't remember dreamy playlist or something I'm gonna try and do if I can finish the card again maybe I'll do some cross stitch later okay. kitchen is already straightened up I've already taken out the trash to add too many sides to this. I'm gonna have my echo today. that's it that's my five minutes of bunny ears i added an audio cue so i'd be able to hear it now
Colors are looking really good on this one at the moment. Weird how sometimes the colors work and sometimes they don't on camera. You just never know. Oh, I, I was very tempted to switch this out for a more Planet Zoo today, but save that for later. Oh, I did this wrong. Slip stitch. Here. Here. Is this playlist? Oops. Oh, that wasn't what I wanted to do. Oh, that definitely wasn't what I wanted to do. That's why I'm not. Peaceful. It's the peaceful playlist.
Right. One down. Loop. Where is the end? Right there. Wasn't I supposed to be doing a starting chain rather than a magic circle for these? I think I was supposed to be doing a, a starting chain. It's fine either way. just the weekly crash it just happened to start uh, to, to crash like right at the beginning which i guess is a good thing oh no that's okay runa i i appreciate the thought and i appreciate you popping back into chat too Yeah, I hope you had a nice stream. What were you working on today? Are you going to sleep? Okay, go get some rest. I look forward to hearing your your adventures next time. Oh, that's cute. The weather dropped a lot, the temperature dropped a lot last night, and it's been raining today. <laughs> I, can, I can feel it in me bones. Like my joints all just feel like really sluggish.
<laughs> I, I feel it. I feel it today. I mean, I I have been I have been using a cane. Well, thank you. I, I actually was using a cane for a bit walking around today. <laughs> I've always been told I have an old head on my shoulders. Maybe it's a, a young head on old shoulders. Yeah, no, you go get some sleep, lovey. And uh, we can catch up next week. I don't want to keep you up. <laughs> Not that I don't appreciate your company, because I do, but yeah. Good night, my dear. Did I do? Oh, I did. I did do it right this time. Okay. I don't even hear you go out. You okay? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Ooh, yummy. I can't remember how many times I've done this, so... A leg surf would be fine. I took the trash out earlier. Yeah. I'm a good girl. It looked like it was going to rain again, so I figured I'd get it up before it started coming down too heavily. Thank you, thank you. I wonder if I can figure out what the happen, what the deal is with the sparkle. I'm 
How you doing? Oh no. We should totally take a... I know I'm sparkling everywhere. Take your your workmate up on that training. Oh, is this where I fucked it up? Okay, I think I fixed up the mistake. We didn't have sparkle yesterday because I broke it when I was streaming. But I think I fixed it. Maybe. Hmm. So are you off work today? Echo pointed out that that one looks like the bees fucking the flower. But well, okay then. Oh, of course, because it's uh, Easter. I always forget about that. Do you feel good about it now? Like, do you have got some understanding of it? Sounds like there's a, I bet there's a lot. Oh God, it's working finally. Okay. Great, great. Oh. That's amazing. But I had no doubts that that's what would happen, but it's always nice to hear it. <laughs> Wait, no, I fixed it and now, now Will turns up. <laughs> I did get it working. Hi, Will. <laughs> it was me that broke it. I think though what happened is too many things went off at once. So all that's happening there well is you're turning the point redemption basically just turns on a, a mask turns off an image mask and then turns it back on And I just forgot how I had it set up. But I got it now. Incoming ad, by the way. If anyone's watching, go take a uh, take chance to go you know, get a coffee or poop or something. Okay. I am, I'm always a busy bee, except actually, I oh know I'm not. Or poop, you know? Something that'll take a few minutes. I've been talking up. Look, I. I'm seriously con considering contacting Benny Fiber and being like, do you want me to be a spokesperson? Because I am totally sold on your product. It's amazing.
genuinely, I think everyone should be taking Benny Fiber. Not Benny Full, that's dog food. I learned that one the hard way. Actually, not the hard way, but the good way. Wait! Ow! Mm -mm -mm. Ow! I've got flowers all over my face! <coughs> Ow, thank you! Put those up, up there. What color square do you want, Al? I think last time you had orange. Was that a reminder? Nope. Yellow. Okay. Four or nine. Al. Chino. Yellow. Right. It has been added to the list. Yeah, I was, I've been trying to convince Flint that he should try it as well. Um, because, you know, when you're streaming as well, it's kind of awkward when you have to stop midstream because you've got some variety of digestive upset. And I haven't had to do that once since I started taking that Benny Fiber. So... Yeah. And it's literally just, I just put a spoon of it into my coffee and I can't taste it or anything. So I'm all like, I just want everyone to, to poop good. I want you all to com have comfy poops. Yeah, I can imagine. So are you, are, do your shifts, will your shifts be changing week to week um, to, to fill in? <clears throat> oh yeah, that's going to be a huge one, especially with all that physical stuff. I suppose you're filling in gaps and... Well, I mean, if they they all like you as as much as they do, you may find you get offered um, more hours or like permanent hours. Yeah, I used to. Um, I used to get these though in New Zealand. It's called up and go, and it was like a little, like a juice juice box sized a protein shake thing because I can't I can't eat when I first wake up usually they like you um and so I used to just do that I'd have a couple of these little like strawberry or chocolate protein drinks um and it was something that I could like quickly I could just like chug on my way to work or you know on a break and I didn't have to think about it Drinking is so much easier than eating. I wish I don't know what they're technically called. They're like, oh, you get them. Whoa, you can get them dairy free now. That's fancy. It's called liquid breakfast. I think it's just got like a bit of fiber and a bit of protein in it, maybe. Yeah, no, I'm not a breakfasty person at all. Like, there's some things I can handle, but like anything with eggs when I first wake up is just a hard no. <laughs> right? Um, but yeah, the meal replacement drinks. Uh, we're uh, definitely a, a thing that I take advantage of when I'm feeling too iffy to eat. Funny enough, one of the things that I can eat at any time is uh, hash browns and fries. You can't have fries at breakfast time. No one bloody sells them.
I love hash browns so much. Mm, potato. I'm really sad, like, the last few times we've been at our local Burger King, um, their fries are almost always just really terrible. And so we started getting onion rings instead, because if we order on the mobile app it's cheaper. But apparently onion rings? My body's just like, lol, you idiot, and I get like wicked heartburn. So I started getting fries again. And it's just like, no. Oh. It makes me sad. The, oh, I do, steak, and fr steak and shake fries are really good too. And they're almost always fresh, which helps a lot. Sorry. <laughs> Actually, last week, what did we get from Publix last week? They had some sweet potato, like waffle cut fries, buy one, get one, that we've got in the freezer. I don't normally like sweet potato things, but I had a craving for them and they're still in the freezer. And you should have known this was a risk of coming into my channel. I am sorry though. Ooh. Chuck some on the air fryer. You don't even have to think about it. Yummy. Uh, it's slowed down a lot, um, but it's still a good size. It's a couple of feet, easy. I keep forgetting to update the uh, picture. Oh, where's, where are my stitch markers? <laughs> Four, five, six, seven, eight. It's 12 squares across, and each square is two and a half inches. Uh, 24, 25, 26, 27, about 20, 28 inches across now. So oh, it's, it's getting there. I'm really enjoying watching the like the little just like groups of colors that sort of seem to appear. There's like little clusters of like greens and blues and pinks. And then every now and then it'll be like a random color. Like my first five were today were all pink and blue and then Elle's like yellow.
really like this pink. This yarn is so nice to work with too. It's the uh, Joann's brand. Big Twist, I think it's called. It's uh, it's cool and rainy here today. It's bizarre. I was so overheating last night, and then I came into my bedroom, my office this morning, and it was cold. It was like fifty something degrees in here. Sixty six now. It's still chilly. It's like fifty nine and rainy. I love it. Feels like 56. And then tomorrow's high is 68. So I'm just, and it's supposed to be rainy. So my my day off tomorrow is going to be like cozy. So excited. I don't have to worry about the lawns because, well, it's raining. And, and the kitchen like we've stayed on top of the kitchen all week so i don't have like a mountain of cleaning to do in there yeah it would be it oh it's 65 i was gonna say it, it might be warmer at your place than mine yeah it's 58 here 56 56 i can't open my window but i do have my door open that fresh air and we we almost always have the front or the back door open during the day definitely the front door less so the back door because stray cats have started coming into our back door to eat the cat food random cats like hey what's up and i'm like ah uh, you're not our cat this is not for you But yeah, front door is almost always open, even when it's really cold in winter, because I don't I feel claustrophobic otherwise. I've got it's chilly in my room, but I like it. Okay. That was Ravi's one. Now it's Vixen's. I just love how like when you've got the windows open it's like fresh air coming through and it's all like crisp especially when it's been raining I might be able to finish my cardigan today. I don't know if it's going to be able to fit me. I may have to put it as a uh, an auction item. I forgot how many sides a square had just then.
Google just asked me if I'd ever owned an Apple Mac laptop. Weird survey question. Yeah, blanket's large enough now that I've got to start folding it so that it fits under the camera. Yes. Every it's been it's so wet out there and every now and then a gust of wind will come up and you can hear it shake all the water off the leaves. You get this like bit of pattering of water drops falling. Such a lovely sound. Hey. Pink, blue, pink, pink, blue, and yellow. Put these away.
color we want. Chellstrom. Do another. Really pretty blue. Yeah, the chain stuff seems to be working out better for these. Keep dropping shit on the floor. Oh wait, I just realized I need to check. I've got another one to add in actually. People who booked their colors in advance.
Gut. Okay. find my nice bright yellow. I don't know where I put it. Oh, stabbing. Yes, it's artistic stabination. Yeah. I'm glad to think so. It's pretty cathartic. Certainly a lot more relaxing than when I first started. Yeah, I think I've got a square for Warlock. I need to put in this bunch as well. How you doing? Going on there. Just squish it. No one will know the difference. Sounds like a nice treat. This does the battery recharging. Well, I hope you have a nice relaxing afternoon. Donut sounds good. Got sure what I'm doing tomorrow is my day off. I think I'm going to go up and read for some of it and then binge watch some of my show that I enjoy the rest of it. Green. Sorry, just have to get a, get a yarn. A yarn. Older yellow, not those ones. Ow. That one, and we'll do that one. Loose ends, we'll shove them in there. Be fine. No one will know any better. Let's 
does L square. He requested yellow. Like a, a mustard yellow. I don't think I've ever had a bubble tea. I'm not entirely sure what a bubble tea is. Okay, and and what do the what is that? At? Oh, it's just a for a textury thing. Hmm. Interesting. I was like, but what does purpose for face? But no, okay, that makes sense. I don't know if I like the idea of gooey stuff at the end of tea, but I guess you wouldn't know until you tried it. Hmm. Curious. So it doesn't alter the flavor in any way. It's just a textural thing. Sorry, I, I just now have like a million questions about bubble tea. <laughs> I'm like, but why? <laughs> Where's it come from? What's it for? <laughs> why was it made? Who accidentally put tapioca pearls in a tea? In... Doing, hey, this is a good idea. <laughs> oh, okay, that's interesting. Someone was just like, whoops, I dropped my balls in my drink. Well, gotta drink it anyway. Oh, hey, I like this chewy stuff at the bottom. have to redo the folding on this. <laughs> I know I had like a nice bright bright yellow and I I don't know where
Nope, I know where it is. It's it's connected to another project right now. to sharpen my scissors. Hold it this way. I think this is kind of teal-ish. It's supposed to be slight, but close enough. It's a bluey green. And then this will be the last square for this week.
can move on to the caddy. This is a fuckload of sirens. I wonder if weather is causing problems. People here don't know how to drive in rain. People here don't know how to drive, and that's coming from me when I'm clearly a terrible driver. You can also hear seagulls, which means it must be bloody windy at the coast. Right, last square, and then on to the next thing. That's a wonderful idea. <laughs> Noki, thank you for redeeming bunny ears. Actually, my camera frame clips them out a little bit, but hello. Hi. I will oh, I will move back a bit so you can see more bunny ears. Bunny! <laughs> it pots bunny ears and makes me pull my bunny ears on for five minutes. Well, yeah, I mean, that's the appropriate response. Bunny! Okay, let me put this yarn away and then we can switch projects. Oh. And we switch over to this. <laughs> Let's 
this one. And I think that the hook is in here already. This is looking pretty good. Oop. I was like, ah, what is that on my hand? It's my bunny ears. It's big enough I can use it as a lap blanket now. So what we're working on now this. And I'm on the last stretch. Oh, yeah, my star went. Oh, there it is. Well. Disc is getting cramped. Hi, Chucky. Okay. Then I've got coffee. Whoa. The yarn sleeve has just given up completely. Go over here too. So what we're working on is... I've got nine more rows like that i think two three four five six seven eight nineteen yeah nine more rows of that and then it's putting it together if i can get through nine more rows of that my five minutes of bunny ears up thank you for hanging out long enough to have those points these markers and these stitches just to make it easier on the return trip to work into it
mostly that's it for that first row everything's worked into chain spaces which makes life a lot easier I just realized I forgot to post when I was going live on uh, Twitter. Oh well, no one sees them anyway. Very good. I don't need that one. <laughs> Thank you. 
ไหมเผยเผยอี I might actually finish this today maybe I always put Yay! I already. Oh, I've got so much candy in my room. I don't know. I'm molting. Well, I hope it's a nice time. Is it chilly down there? Because it's like 50 something here, and I've, I've, I've been sitting here just on the verge of goosebumps. It's uh, 55. And it's been rainy. Yeah, just oh no, never mind. I got the goose. Oh, you can't say. But I got the goose bumps. I think I should put my caddy on. That's a good pen. Is no, that's fine. Look away. That pinning option is handy. Yeah, maybe. It was warmer and rainy yesterday. And then it just kind of, I don't know, temperature plummeted. I'm going to say before I can feel it and be bones today. I'm just going to go grab my cat. In my old bones. <sighs> ah, yes. Or you could do what I did in Mel's stream once and accidentally ban someone. Maybe. It makes me happy. I like it when it's rainy and cool. Normally it's rainy and hot. No, it's okay. I appreciate you popping in. Have a good time at the arcade. Fun. Five more rows. I can do this. Maybe. Thank 
think now It's a key. This is a weird playlist. It sounds familiar, this instrument. Is it a sitar, maybe? Oh, that's Flint Street. <laughs> I was like, what is this music? It's weird. Thank you. 
be very happy if I can get this completed. This is definitely a grindy watch TV project that I really want to finish. Any second now. Here it is. Thanks, Dolan. I can do this. Having that stitch marker there just makes it so much easier.
Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Come on. Just, just four more rows. I need to bring actually bring up the pattern and find out how to put the whole bloody thing together. It's off to the arcade. Your ice cream. I can hear the ice cream truck. You can need the ice cream truck. That means you need ice cream. You should do it. Unless your ice cream truck is like the ice cream truck we get here, where in fact they don't sell ice cream, so I'm pretty sure they just sell drugs. The last time I went looking for the ice cream truck, I couldn't find it. I heard it drive into the apartments across the road. And it never came out. That is very smart, Ali. I'll take Octavius and get him a, a pup ice cream. Ooh. 
That's a big difference. Especially with gas being as much as it is. That sounds very not fun. I think non-refundable deposits on places like that are absolute bullshit. Especially considering how much they almost all claim they need as a non-refundable deposit. Even if someone falls through, you're going to find another tenant. Hmm. Yeah, but it still seems predatory to me. Was that the one that, um, the place that you, you were looking at, is that the one that the current management company said? You said like there was a, a lady from them who'd found a place for you? That makes no sense. Especially if you're already on their books. It's not like you're a new client. Yeah. Seems a bit dodgy. You already have an established, you know, like payment record and stuff. Yeah. <coughs> well, hopefully you can find a place with a different group because you might have more luck. In terms of getting help when needed. Oh, thank you. Yeah, they're... My nails were so short, I couldn't get the entire little pictures on them all. <laughs> but I really like that little gradient. It makes me feel fancy. God, they've shrunk a lot. Yeah, it sounds like a good idea. Like, you're such a cretin. Is that normal? Do you have suns and moons on your nails? Hi, Luke. Would you like me to paint your car? Put suns and moons on your pretty car, Luke. Except it's green instead of... Red. Is 
This playlist is so weird. I've got to decide what I want next time. What are these all? This is, this is like crazy. Look at them all. These are all nail stickers. Look, look. Yeah, Flynn's mom decided she didn't want to use them after all. So I've got like... <laughs> so many! I really like those. But yeah, like my nails, like that's what this set looks like, except full colour, kind of. But my nails are so small that I don't get all the patterns. Oh. It, yeah, it does, Lou. Like, those are kind of neat, too. I really like these ones. That's what I've got on now, but just a different color. I need my nails need to get longer because half of the designs on them won't even show but just I got little fingers yeah so if you, if you want some nail stickers let me know <laughs> I can hook you up They're really cool though, like, so you put like a clear coat of varnish on underneath and then you put the stickers on and then you don't need, you like trim them, but then you just like get a, an emery board and just like file it down and put a clear coat over top. That's the, uh, that's the leftovers from this current set. I don't know why I'm saving the half ones. So maybe I could like cut out circles or something, but. But I'll never be able to do the fancy shit myself. Like I don't have a steady hand for that sort of thing. Got these two. I can't even reach my toenail. <laughs> Not without a great deal of stretching. Oh. Like these are real pretty. I've got a few of them. But I've got so many colours now I can probably like combine leftovers from other sets. It's like I I got a lot of nail things. <laughs> but I like it because I don't like I feel really paranoid when I'm doing my crafting streams if my nails uh, look gross. So this sort of covers it up. And I like having pretty nails, even though they're like really short. I have such stubby little fingers. I can't have like really long nails because they just break off. Luke, were you were you a good boy? Did the Easter Bunny bring you lots of eggs? I did see your your pic was it the picnic bars, and I was like, oh no, now I want candy.
Oh man, I do love cream eggs. I used to always get, um, no matter how old I was, my granddad would always get me just like a straight up like hollow Cadbury egg with with um, buttons in it, chocolate buttons. I was just like, mmm, chocolate buttons are amazing. But yeah, I saw that picture and then I was like, oh no, I started thinking about pixie caramels. And that terrible, chronically outdated ad that I remember seeing of like, you know, any last request and the guy asks for a pixie caramel and then everyone falls asleep. That sounds neat, Ali. I don't even know. I bet they don't even show the Pixie Caramel ad anymore because of politically correct reasons or something. And it was something about the the little chocolate buttons inside that Easter egg that just made it like extra special. Here is. I was gonna make. Oh, maybe I'll make some hot cross buns tomorrow. <laughs> buns. I never lasted long enough for that but yeah like the solid ones were like real fancy but now we get I get my easter egg with the chocolate buttons in from grandma and granddad chocolate buttons were literally just like little circles of chocolate, like chocolate coins almost, but without the foil. Thanks, Luke! Have a good lurk. Lurk. It certainly wasn't a bit as big a deal when I was growing up. It was just kind of like, yeah, Easter. My family weren't particularly traditional with any stuff, so... Pixie caramel ad was good. So pixie caramels are like really chewy toffee bars that were covered in chocolate. And the premise of this ad that was always on when I was little for it was there'd be a guy in a firing squad lineup. And I guess like the governor or the president or whatever would be like walking down the line asking people for last requests. And the main character of this ad would be like, I'd like a pixie caramel. And the governor's like, yeah, well, weird, but okay. And so he starts chewing on them and it takes so long to eat because it's so chewy that all the prison staff fall asleep and then he makes his escape. It's a very dark premise for a candy bar ad. <laughs> And it's like, I don't know, it's, it's, it's clearly supposed to be set in America. But 
but this is like the 80s in New Zealand. I don't know. I wonder if I can find it. It's bizarre. Oh, you found it? Oh, God. That is, that is, that's it. That's absolutely it. Oh, stop, stop, stop. It's just such a weird, like I hadn't even thought about it in the longest time. Wait, why is that not right? Any last requests? A uh, pixie caramel? Oh, German. Pixie caramel is my only chance because smooth, creamy pixie caramel is a longer lasting chew. Mm. While I keep chewing, they'll get tired of waiting and fall asleep. Pixie caramel with a delicious chocolate and caramel <laughs> taste. <laughs> Saved again. Pixie okay, so it was like I guess I'd, I still don't know quite what the accent is for these bad guys. Like if it it's not quite true, it's not American. Any last requests? Because uh, he's got like that rolled R. But yeah, I was just like, oh. That's what I, as soon as you posted the, that candy earlier, Luke, this is what I started thinking of. It's so dated. Said it was like a 1993 ad? Thank you for finding it, Ali. That was, uh, <laughs> that was a, a funny thing to look at. But there was like this whole thing. There was like, the Milky Bar Kid, which is like white chocolate, and the Milky Bar Kid would like save people on a train from like train robbery. Lots of these ads were like focused around crime. I'm not, I mean, it's really good. I do miss a good pixie caramel. It's kind of like I've had the get a, a curly whirly in England, which is the same sort of chewy caramel, but it's not quite the same. Such a weird. And then there was, oh, there were pinky bars too, which were like strawberry marshmallow. And, oh, when I was 12, I had a big crush on a boy called Bowen in an intermediate school, middle school. And at Valentine's, I got a pinky love heart and gave it to him, and he laughed at me and ate it. And he broke my heart. And then I was over it the next day. But. And the ad for that was. Like a grease type theme? I think. <laughs> Those weird candy bar ads. Yeah, screw you, Bowen. Look what you're missing out on. Stupid name, anyway. Should have just kept the candy bar for myself. It's like a little love heart. Oh, and then there was, oh, what was the other one? A banana something? <laughs> it was, there were like three guys in my year who were named Bo Bowen. It was clearly like a, a name for, you know, like a trending name. Weird. There were lots of Bowens and Quintons and Trevors.
I didn't think Bowen was so lovely after that. Michaels. We had five Catherines in my year. And <laughs> we were, they were all spelt differently. And five of them. Lots of Mikes and Jennifers. It's funny how there's name trends like that. Well, the funny thing was, there was, like, up until, like, I moved city when I was nine. And so in my primary school, my elementary school, there was no one else with my name. So it must have been, like, a regional thing almost. Because then I moved to Auckland. And like I said, by, by the time I got to high school, there were five Catherines in my year. Apparently, Aucklanders just liked naming their kids Catherine. I think I don't even use that name now unless I'm putting it on official stuff. I like it, yeah. It's a pretty name. I can't think if there were any other ones that had a lot of duplicates, but I can't think of any. No, uh, Daniels. We had a lot of Daniels and a lot of Brian's. And my like, my immediate circle of like guys I hang out with, we had, there were two Daniels. There was two Daniels, a Brian and a Matthew. And those were like the four guys that I hang out with the most through like most of my school years. And Chris, lots of Chris's too. Isn't that weird? Like it wasn't even a very busy, big school. Yeah, actually there were definitely a few Jasons there as well. I mean, there's so many interesting names in, in the world and everyone just goes for... the same ones. But I suppose there's so much into picking a name, I, I can't even imagine what it's like. What do we got? How many am I at now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two more. Chatting about chatting about these things has made me like pick up the speed and now I'm getting closer to I need nine rows. Two more rows of this, and then I have to look up con construction information. Hmm. It's, that's always interested me when you get like one kid who's got like a, a, a sort of exotic sounding name and then the other is just like Bob. I always just assume that by the by the time the second one comes around they're like, you know, we're, we're not going to go through the same thing this time. <laughs> just just name him for your father. Or something like that. Those are your cats, aren't they?
Oh, is that? Okay, I was curious about that. Because that that's a an indigenous name, right? Yeah, so I'm pretty sure those names are, Le are Luke's cats. I mean, we've got what our animals are Daisy, Squeaky, and Boots. I I remember people's pets' names. I don't. <laughs> I can't remember what I had for breakfast, but I can remember someone's pet's name. Oh my god, Dreamer's cats. Luke, I Dreamer posts so many think, videos of her cats on Instagram and they're amazing cats. Like, I love, there's like your cats and then there's Dreamer's cats and it's just like, yes, fill up my feed with adorable critters. So good. I think I have to change this playlist. It is just, just, it's just a bit much. I am struggling with motivation here. Let's see if I can find something a little bit more upbeat. <laughs> Angry, busy and frantic, changing tempo, chasing dark. Maybe Floating? <gasps> Dead. Aww. Sweet babies. Oh, the coat. This coat's so shiny. Let's see. Hang on. Sorry. I, I was enjoying this, but it's getting a bit too much. Oopsie. No, I'm just, you know what? I don't, I don't think I want, like, slow stuff. He is a very pretty cat. Let's go for this. It's still like ambient and quiet, but hopefully less. I hate I hate switching music playlists up. I'm sorry. It drives me nuts, but it's just not doing it for me. We want bagpipes. Funeral songs. What's this? Let's try this. All right, there we go. This will do. This is better. Uh... There. I'm sorry, I'll stop messing with the music. Here's some disco vibes. We are. Totally different energy. Perfect. Now I'm just going to be like doing little cheer boogies. Oh, 
hopefully no one was like trying to doze off to my stream because I would have just woken them up. We ha we've got two cats, but well, no, I think two cats have us. Specifically, two cats have flint. They tolerate me, but they they love flint. Even though they're like scaredy outside cats, they will try and look for him if they can hear his voice, which is really cute. But they're really hard to get pictures of because they don't like sudden movements or anything. I got a bit, a little bit, tried to get a picture of squeak of uh, boots. Sorry, but. She's a, it's a really terrible picture, but she's just like a little tiny thing with a... She's a really small cat. I had to like zoom in a lot to get her. So I get too close, she's like, nah, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> nah, no, nah, I don't want that. This is so much better. Shit. I'm still really enjoying the fact that there's like all these new songs to listen to that I haven't heard in a couple of years. I'm very concerned what this is actually going to look like when it's completed. And then I have to find a pattern for two and a half thousand yards of this DK weight yarn. I have an idea, actually. But we'll see.
Hi, Luna. Thanks for treat. May have another pineapple ring. Pineapple gummies from our Easter basket. Yummy. Man, I keep forgetting about my coffee. Which doesn't taste great after pineapple candy. Lesson learned. Pineapple and coffee? Nope. I can't, I still like can't stop thinking about that fucking zoo game. That's the problem with that game. I get, it get I get so focused on these things that I want to play them to the exclusion of everything else. But if I take like a couple of days off, then I'm done. I run out of steam for them, I guess. You know, I do keep wanting to play that WRC game again. Even though I sucked at it. But not with my wheel. It was, it was too hard with the wheel. I need to check, but I'm pretty sure that if I turn it, this last row is the last row for the pattern. But let's just double check. in February last year. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, construction seems pretty simple. Repeat fan stitch section until panel measures five inches or nine rows. Probably should have made that longer.
Well, how have I got such a different one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, or eleven? Ah, uh, shoot! No, there might still a couple more rows. <laughs> okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nineteen, eleven. 12 rows, so I still have four more to go, curses. I'm glad I checked though before cast binding off. Damn it. I don't know if I'm supposed to block this. Some talk about blocking. Okay. Alright, and so I've got what how many now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So four we're still still four more. Always four more. Oh, it even says 12 on my little pad. I'm so gutted that I still have to do more rows. I thought I'd come close to finishing. I mean, I could, but I'd end up with uneven sized leaves. That wouldn't be ideal. At least I needn't have worried about running out of yarn.
That reminds me of the start of a Tiffany song. No, the rose definitely is for speeding up with the uh, less I'm falling asleep music. This is the row that I thought was the last row, but in fact is not the last row. That's not the last row. Whoopsie. to go. No, really. Oh, and I have to weave in these tails, but there's not really much to weave in. There's only like one tail on each piece. Or two tails on each piece. So. Because I got these large skeins, there's no joins.
To me, do I keep making dumb mistakes? limbs. I didn't realize I started this in February last year.
All right. Whoops. Nah, stop it. Go after this. Not sure what method they want to uh, use to to connect them. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yes, two more. Yeah, they don't seem right. Seven, eight,
guessing with joining, I'm not supposed to be using these little holes that I've got on the sides. Foundation chains. Yeah, no, I'm not using it seam at all.
Hey, no, what? That's a flower. Well, hi, hello, welcome. Thank you for joining us. Sorry, I'm a little bit, I was a little bit zoned out there. Trying to push through the last couple of rows on this. Feel free to do uh, luck or uh, natter away, whichever you're the most comfy with. One more row after this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. One more row. Final row. Now it's the final, final row. Like the actual final row.
I'm a little worried about how this is supposed to get stitched together. I guess I'm just going to have to mess about with a few different techniques and see what works. The other thing I'm not sure of is this yarn is multicolored. I don't know if I should be. Using it or like using threads? It, or like embroidery floss or I don't know. I guess yarn is uh, the ideal but It's variegated so it's gonna I don't know if it's going to show up stitching a lot or not. my problem is when I started making this a year ago um, size was different it was a lot less I have a bad feeling that isn't gonna fit me It feels good trying to finish project.
Okay. That was the last row. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Just do a comparison. The other sleeve. mind that the sizes are going to be different a bit here right so one two three four five six seven nine ten five six five two doubles two b's two doubles two three four five six Holes one, two, three, four, five, six, nine, eight, nineteen, eight, nineteen, eighteen, nine. Okay, the same, they are the same. So Even ends. Saying Indicating to not weave in ends until after I've stitched it together. Okay. No. She don't need the sleeves now. That's the same. <laughs> wrong side up. There isn't a wrong side up. I literally don't have a wrong side up. So. Line uh, with aligning foundation chains. Just so it's all the same. I wonder if I should try and use one of these tails. You know what? I'm going to take a quick bio break and then I'll come back and figure it out.
Okay. Well, let's... That together. Ankle. And we are up to the construction parts of putting this together. And I have concerns. Yay! You got it! Well, I, I've never had to... S yeah, I've never done this before? So this is the shoulder seam here. I'm not familiar with... Yeah, I'm not, I'm not entirely sure where I'm supposed to stitch, so I figure if I like try and line these up a little bit, like these, like the holes, it should just let me pin it loosely in place. Like it tells me what stitch to use, but it's all still Okay, so like there ish. We had to change the music up from being like mellow stuff because it was it was putting me to sleep. You're a flower. Thank you. Welcome in. Hey, I'm trying to like line these bits up. Here, there. I'm gonna pin that. I feel like that's a, a solid premise. It, like I'm supposed to do whip stitch. I'm not sure. I guess through the the, found the starting chain. All right. So let's do the same thing here. This is like the the only item of like clothing that I've done. Here, 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 here. Okay, well that's a good. It's it's joining up pretty close, which is what the pattern shows. Like there's basically this is the shoulder and then these are the the front panels that come down here.
Where is that? So this is basically how I'm supposed to... trying to tidy this up so it's got less clutter. Whoops. Keep hitting tab instead of backspace. All right, so this is basically the instruction for like putting it together. So that's what I've got here. It's like wrong side of face, wrong side of facing. I'm like, I, there is no wrong side. Um, I don't know if these tails are going to be long enough. So I guess I'll find out. Um, also, I don't know if needle might be too big. Let's try this one. Yeah, so this is this the smaller ones here. Actually, if I flip this around, that's the arrangement that I've got. So the piece on the left is is the, is the back, and then the two pieces, the smaller pieces, are the front and the the front left and front right panels. So we do a seam along here first, and join these to create the shoulders, which is this bit here. I'm so nervous about sewing this together. Like, I can make a freaking Megara bee. I can put, I can do this. I can. I could always set it on fire. That's, that's always an option as well. Even though it's taken me like a year to get to this point. Unless you set something on fire. You can't unburn something. I mean, is there any other process? You know what? I feel like using the tail is not a smart idea. I don't know how much I don't know how much yarn I need to to put it together. Like surely four times the length of the seam would be enough, right? Five times? 
six? Let's try six. Six is a good number. And if it's, it's, it's not like I don't have a lot of this yarn. See what you did there. You know Littles has got a nice emote, right? It, it, it's perfect. I should just have it set to automatically do that myself. So that would be kind of like stealing, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna start this side first and work, work towards me. All right. So gently, but firmly, here oh I think I did a brain gravy okay leave five to six inches of tail at the end Where does that go? In this one? You can use any of the loops from your stitches but the light you like, but the key is consistency. Box! You're like you seem to be really sturdy. Go through. I'm working across myself here. All right, I think we'll be okay. Oh, wow. Uh, I need to do laundry tomorrow. Ooh. Um. Laundry. <laughs> Can't decide. Yes, there. I said the key is to be consistent. My concern here. All right. Uh, 
Was I right? Like it. Yeah, no, that went in the wrong place. That's these these stitches here. These are tricky. I don't know how to deal with them. Am I supposed to be doing it back loop only? It literally doesn't say, it just says. Oh, <laughs> it doesn't say anything for you guys. All right, let me flip that back around. I guess it's leaving a, a lot of it up to the creator. I don't understand why they want you to do it. Well, I guess the problem is this yarn is such a different color. Maybe I should try and like get a length of yarn that matches. I think that might help actually, rather than have this like real contrasting color. Cause it's really jarring. It is my world. Let's try and get there. I mean, ultimately, it doesn't really matter. Why are you going to get caught up like that? It's all tangled.
I don't I don't want to have to take take this big chunk out, but I don't I'm gonna be, gonna be able to avoid it to be honest. Um get a bobbin. Try and wind this up a bit as I go. Yeah, I'm pretty sure if I try and match the, the yarn that I'm sewing with to one of those two colours, the pink or the white, it'll just be a bit tidier. I thought I had a bobbin in here. Oh, I do. Right, that's it. I need to head up. My friend was printing me some of these. I'm curious how they came out. Hey, dude. Hope you had a good evening. Good sleep. I really appreciate that raid that, that you guys gave me last night. That was really sweet. But a little? That's good. Well, that was kind of you. Now, this color. Not quite there. Okay, that might stand out less of a, a sore thumb than before. If we can get to what's the problem with this yarn with all the different colors in it i'm trying to get it like not too jarring think about this Not sure if I want to try and use pink here. I'm gonna try and get the pink yarn. Oh, it's pink on both sides. All right. Oh. I think I have made poor choices. Poor choices were made. That's the color there, but going on to white.
He's white on that side. What, is the pink after the white? It's oh, that's a lot though. I think I'd be better off if I can get to a pink section. It's tempting to use the white there, but yeah, pink goes all the way across, so... I decided that I needed to wind this first. Is that what I mean? A nightmare. Come on. Shake loose, please. There we go. Get the yarn winder off of this. It's a problem with the center pull on the really, really large skeins. That was a good, good release there. Hope the yeah, the pink section's quite pink section of yarn's quite large, so that should work there. be far off the pink now surely I'm assuming I would just be able to do it in one long stitch one long row
I can see the pink yarn. I just have to get it in the midst of this. Definitely have to get the yarn winder out for the rest of the skein. this idea of I'm gonna kick myself for saying it but doing like a granny blanket with this yarn with like the center of the squares and white and the outside edges in and the oh, I'm sorry the center of the squares in this color and then the outer aha uh -huh, uh, the outer bits and what all right Try and get the entire pink section of the yarn. Here. Oh, I, <laughs> I don't know what color that is. It's fine. gonna start from the bottom and work my way up I'm not working over myself got these ends in so
through here. And then there's one V in the middle. Why am I doing that for? What is <laughs> my brain? This is way, way too long. But I don't want to cut it. These we're gonna aim for yeah. And on this side we're aiming for oh you know there is a front and a back. Hi Grim. That is the back. I wonder if it's getting so confused. How are you doing today? Yeah, now my stitches look the same on the each side, so I've got the same gaping. That's really good. So, do you know what you did differently? Alright, I don't, I don't think I need the market. Yeah, that's the back. out of the way. Whoops.
Oh, there you go. Yeah, see, that's what I, I do with that planet zoo. I start off with, like, things in a really small habitat. Or, like, I, I start off with the exhibit animals because they're just easier to manage. I'm guessing that's the same, the same idea. God. Far too long. This is why it's too long. Some Struthio Mimus DNA. It's two o'clock. <gasps> well, maybe you'll do a better job of it with some rest. So bad. It sounds like a good idea. I need to I need to count this yard is too long. Oh dear, no don't do that. Poor spider. They do that, sneaky little buggers.
Okay, it's looking all right. So I can do what I can do. Make this longer. Oh dear. Who woke up? A dog? I have very good hearing with that street stuff. That's the problem. Cause I don't know how much. Trying to make sure I get like every stitch. So it's an even stitch on the, the top seam there. Just making it harder for myself. Is that the only tail there? Alright, I I need to cut this yarn. It's still going to be too long, but... Always join in and join it up if I need more. Alright, 
Oh god, yeah, that's gonna be much easier. Big improvement. I don't know if this is what I'm supposed to be doing stitch wise, but it looks okay on that side and it's even. So Sushi. What a surprise! A smaller length of yarn makes a big difference. Oh, did I...? Right, that one wasn't right. Being in the air. Stitching on the inside here. It's supposed to be quite straight, whereas on the outside it's supposed to have a slant.
I, I missed a stitch again. Oh, no, there. Yeah, whoops. It's always through that, that chain. I did it did say that I could just do this through the um back loops of this, but I feel like because it's an item of clothing it probably needs more robust stitching. worrying that my stitches are getting further and further apart but they're not I almost worry, wonder if that side the back side is actually better than the front I guess I'll see when I put it together Something's not right there. That shouldn't be slanted, that stitch.
Okay, that's better. Uh, well, it's not, this, not part of the spider you just squished, was it? You said you stepped on it. Well, you nearly stepped on it, I guess. I was very unimpressed when critters decide to try and land in my lunge. Good night, Grim. Have a good sleep. I have a feeling that this is now going to be too short.
this is the the first time I've really had to do it for an item of clothing. So it's a bit of a, a voyage of discovery here. And I, I never thought that it would really matter. Which direction the 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 crochet was sitting, but no, it does. But I think it looks okay. Like that's the same on the outside and the honestly i think the inside seam looks better but it's desperately trying to make it so it was like even and i tried to match the color to the, the stitching so it wasn't too stand outy Oh, now see, that's not right. I... Oh, there. I'm using like the the back bump of the single crochet as a guide as to like where to sew. It, it mentioned the possibility of just doing back back loop only but i figured because it's a shoulder seam it's a sort of like you you want it to hit be a bit stronger so i hope it works I don't actually mind this too much. What I am expecting though is to find out that I have a tension problem after washing it.
Like I ex expect the uh, the seams to like bunch up. I'm wondering if I should just like loosely tack in the tails and wash it. Just let it sort of settle. I don't know if that's something that I need to worry about. But that said, the benefit of this pattern is it's very gappy and lazy, so it shouldn't really matter too much if the seams pull. I just untwisted you. Stop being a dick. That's wrong.
Okay. Alright. Yeah? Okay. That works. So now I need to weave in the ends. I was really worried that those seams would be like standing out, but I think by going and getting that pink yarn that matches the color there, it's just made a difference. So. Inside. That tail. All right. <laughs> the weaving in of ends. Man, this is the bit that I am not. What if I make it look terrible? I'm gonna get down onto this row here. That's one. Alright, 
Okay, so that's one, two, three. We're weaving in the beans. Okay, there. One. Mm-hmm.
14. No, probably one more actually. Oh, I went down too far here. I'll be in this row. Ow. 
dead foot. I don't know what the song is, but it's weird. Them tails in there. What is this from? Oh, right there. This one first, and then the other one in there. Take it down one more.
Yeah, that's better. Hey, that's that. To rule that, I did barely gave myself a tail for weaving this in. Those ends we woven, weaved, woven in.
Cuman Sí. Good, that's that one. Oh, not cutting them though. why I feel compelled to add just an extra on the side but hey fuck it I'm cutting it Those are mine. Those one. Those one. What he's doing. And next time I do this playlist, I'm gonna make sure it's uh, take the uh, vocal stuff out. What is wrong with me? Right. 
Should I just trim these as well? I mean, they're fine. They are. Let's just do it. So trust the process. okay i'm surprised that this joined up as nicely as it did i mean i followed the instructions so i guess it's not that surprising but that is currently playing. Oh, right there. Oh, shit, okay. Okay, so, uh... Wrong side up. Let's just orient it the way the picture is. Wrong side up, right? Yeah, this is the wrong side up. Right. Flee. Oh, it's more pink. So you know what? Before I do that, I'm gonna weave in these tails. That's all I got. And I have some food here. I just need to stop what I'm doing to eat. Take it over further here.
there. So Scooby. Oh God, that makes me so sad. I was doing so well with like chilling the fuck out with the weaving ends, but hey. Alright, how do I line this fucker up? Line. That's the middle? That seems mid no. That maybe that. Okay. Let's pretend that the yellow one is the middle. And then we're gonna count to check. I feel like these should be okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, fifteen. Fifteen on that side. One, two, three, four, five, six, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay, this is the middle. This is going to be harder to join. Considerably harder to join. out and the height of the stitches here will match the height of the rows. Uh, 
Okay, that's where it's naturally sitting. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eight. One, twenty-two, twenty-three. One, two. Eight, nine, ten. Eight, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three. Okay, so naturally it's aligning up there. I like they're just like, just line them up and stitch them. Sure, easy. So tw okay, so we've got 23 rows, and how many did I say I had here? One, two, three, four, five. Oh, yeah, maybe that way. 23 rows. I've got two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 16, 16, 16, 18. 2, 3, 30. 31. <laughs> Ass. It was too much to hope for that things would line up like that. Okay, we're just going to start using lining things up more. Dirt in our house. I'm supposed to match the stitches up.
the other thing is, if I need the sleeves to sit evenly... Then I really need to start from the shoulder seam and work down. But that will result in a lot of unnecessary fucking around. I think maybe I try and keep this to like back loop it might be okay so like not going through the entire of the fabric that one two Three and then four for tail. Let's see if that's enough. I, I seriously, I don't know where to stitch these. I don't know what patches it has to stitch in. Happy with that, babe. I'm 
I'm just gonna have to eyeball it. I don't think this is going to work at all. No, it's they're just getting more and more out of the way. How is Flint doing? What I need to do is identify a couple of spots on the side of these stitches that are the same interval apart as these little bits here. I was vaguely hoping that I could line up the stitches together. That lines up. Mm. 
Like that is an absolute that that is a spot that doesn't put a marker extra. Same color. If I can find something. to the side of a double crochet how many Stitches are on the side. Looks like it's a thick ridge there, like a raised seam. It's not clear enough, I can't tell. Wait a minute. Are we using this gap here? They are okay. All right, let's try that. point was it explained that that's why there's a double like two double crochets is that one of them is basically right there
So I think now maybe... I should be working left to right. I keep working over crossing over myself. Now we are going from here. Shit. One, two, three, four. I don't know if this is going to work or not. We've got there, there, here, and there. These three. Oh, that's a flower. <laughs> Hi, hello, welcome. Thank you for the follow. Sorry. I got a bit of a spoop there. on that. All right, I'm having a bit of a struggle right now. I'm not really, I'm not sure where I'm supposed to be. Stitching this. Doesn't seem right at all. Oh, it looks awful. <laughs> Where the fuck am I supposed to sew into the side of a double crochet? Awful. 
I, I literally don't know. Like, joining two matching stitches together is fine. But these are all double crochets worked backwards and forwards this way. And this is a stitching going this way. And it's a single. So I don't know how many... I don't know how to line it up. And I was like looking at the picture and it looks like because there's a, a double you start off with two double crochets on the edge here and if you look at the picture there's like a ridge so I'm assuming it's this this first double crochet which is used as a, a seam and and that's that's fine but I don't know how many stitches I'm supposed to put in it. Unless I use the double crochet. The... Yeah. Well, I've got... One, two... Maybe I, I need to be using the, the these as the interval rather than the singles. I just want to make try and figure out so that when I do the other sleeve, it's you know like I just get to it and I'm like okay. Well, see the thing is is it's. 23 rows this way. <sighs> Between here and here. Whoops. This thing. From here to here is 23 rows. Oh, I'm all zoomed in. That doesn't help. And then from there to there is 15, 15 stitches or 31, depending on how you count things. I was vaguely hoping that I could match these up with the bars. And the pattern is literally like, just throw it on. Align the center of the seams, yeah. Got that right there. That's the center all lined up. And then I've got 23 rows each way, so I know it's like even.
Let me look at those. <sighs> so there's a starting chain of 98 singles. Forty-nine aside. Wait, wait, forty-nine. What? Oh, forty-nine. No, never mind. <laughs> I was like, girls, it's a number that rounds up, but no, it doesn't. I was vaguely hoping it would like d divide nicely. <sighs> All right. Let's. Just to verify, this is 23. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, 23. Here we have Oh, wait, 16? Wait. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, fourteen, fifteen. Okay. Yeah, that is the middle. This one. This is the one. Okay. Oh, music stopped. Did I do that? Or did the playlist just hit bottom? I have no idea what just happened there. So though those line up there. Five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven. 
Steven. Be there. The only way I can think of is just to like line it up with stitch markers. And then just try and stitch it evenly in between. Jesus. So that's perfectly lined up. I just have to make it look good.
It's so confusing. I feel like there's a really obvious thing as well. It's gotta be like that. It's gotta go like that. Used for darning needles, but So it's like there, 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 there. I don't fucking know.
They're so, the stitches are so big though. I mean, is that going to hold? I guess?
All right. <gasps> Do that quickly and just see what it looks like. I think. Yeah. Alright, so I think what I'll do is I'll come through and I'll just tighten the stitches up. Because my main thing is I wanted to just have the stitches even. I use like the stitch markers to like count off where I would want to, to join them. <laughs> if all else fails, math. Yeah, it is. It absolutely is. All right. Oh. Oh. Uh, no, that's all right. I understand. I don't know what spelling mistake is fine. Right, I'm not going to remove the uh, markers on this side yet. I, I don't even know what that means. See? goes i haven't been able to see a doctor for 15 years uh and before i came here uh yeah so when i was in england i had full coverage and then i had to just stop taking everything before i came here so i i understand um but i don't i try not to uh do the trauma thing on stream because it can start a cycle. That I'm not able to deal with. No, it's alright. You don't have to be quiet. Just be aware that, uh, you know, my brain is a bit balked too. So I struggle as well. And have limited resources.
entirely just making this shit up as I go. be fine. I'm not saying that your feelings aren't valid, Noki, just that I don't know how to process them myself. Uh, and therefore, I'm not much use. If you had a good afternoon. Yeah, I saw you like Ratchet and Clank. But did you did you push the big red shiny button? And no, you can't prove I was looking at Twitter while I was streaming. Shut up. What happened? You know, I've never played any of those games, so I know nothing. Translens, hello. <laughs> Things happened. Oh dear. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's five years in May. I hope you're both doing well. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! It was like I was there, Luke. Things started exploding. All right, so let's see if I can replicate what I did on one first side on the other. Where have all my stitch markers gone? You can! Yo, Havoc still streams as well. Right there. So that's our center point there. that it's this one. It's all about pretend. Let's do let's zoom it out. Right. 15 I think, right? One, two, three, four. Okay, whoops. doing all right thank you how about yourself three four five six seven eight seven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen okay so we have our center point Let's... i'm attempting to put together a cardigan and it's the first time I've made an item of clothing rather than just like 
A square? Or a toy? And it's, it's pain and experience. Oh, oh, did I? Sure, it's the right way around. All right, I gotta make sure it's the wrong way around. Back. Ah, shit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nineteen, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Here. Think, yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. All right. So this is our center center point here, marked with a double finger. Take that off now. And then. I can't remember how I arranged it. finish it tonight. I think maybe I'm being a little bit ambitious. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, eight, twenty, one, twenty, two, twenty-three. This is fine. I need more markers. Another one, that's the worst one. I know I have more somewhere. I think they just vanish. Right, one, so we go up here. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is the center. And we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. What? Eleven. It should be eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Here.
Alright. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay. Okay. I think I can remember the rhythm of the stitching. I just have to keep on checking that I'm stitching the right sides here. Right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Here. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, nine. Two. do it here Six, oh counting that one what and Okay, so we're doing, yeah, I think we're good. as long as the stitching is consistent it's not really going to be a problem um, 
grease the tail there. Let's get rid of this. You know, we don't need this anymore. Ah, wait a minute to here. Yeah. I think it's working. <gasps> Yay, good job, Luna. Oh. <laughs> well, I <laughs> I mean, is there such a thing? Wait, did you buy too much or did you eat too much? Okay, so you you bought too much Reese's at full price? <laughs> okay. I mean, what I what I'm getting from you will is that you like Reese's. Would that be reasonable to to assume? <laughs> Flint Flint loves Reese's as well, and also loves that I hate them because it means that he gets all the Reese's. I get it. There's there's some candies that I will like I will do things for. So I get it. Oh, peanut M&Ms. Look, I thought we were friends. Oh no, that did go. Wait, what? No, they didn't go in the right place. <laughs> no, it's weird. I get it. I get it. Like, licorice. I fucking love anything with licorice in. And Flint does, can't stand it. So, it means I don't have to share with him. Like, I haven't seen them here, but they used to, back home, you used to be able to get in dairies. You used to be able to get these, like, licorice sticks covered in chocolate. 
and I fucking loved those. I would buy like $10 at a time from the local dairy to a point where they stocked extra because they knew what I was like with them. Dairy bean convenience store for anyone who doesn't speak New Zealand. Um, oh, they were so good. I have I have my mountain of caramel M and M's that I'm. That's gonna take me forever to get through those. I don't think I've even. There's so many different types of M and M's now. It's crazy. It is nice though with Flint and I like Flint really loves like not loves but Flint likes cherry flavored stuff as well and we all know I don't like cherry flavored stuff so works in his favor. hungry but I want to finish this because I never finish things <laughs> I want to finish oh no now Flint's into this stream gonna do for stream next week um i don't know if i'm still gonna be on the note on the planet zoo bender i i worry that it bores people but i really enjoy it i feel like maybe i should just keep writing that until i'm done Especially now that I've started my trailer park zoo. can do this oh wait what can I yes I can so now I know if I want to really grease Will up uh, Provide him with oopsie with Reese's. Been on the wrong one. Went on the wrong hole. That's because it went in the wrong place. There.
there. Head speeder. Oh, was it here? Uh, what? Did I just accidentally do a fucking wreck? Oh, not that one. That one. I think I've got a bit wonky. I think this will be in the armpit anyway, so you won't be able to tell. No one's going to look at my armpits. Abandon hope. That's the message if you want to venture there. Seems pretty even. Oh no, why is the tail there? Ah, but you didn't get enough of them after the ice storm? Oh, wait, did I put them in the wrong side? you had a pleasant evening. Okay. Oh, okay. needle go there like 35 of your family so 
Is that what you're saying? Oh god. That's a that's a lie. struggle when there's more than three people. <laughs> Not much use. I think the last bit should be relatively easy. Trying to decide what we're going to do for stream this week. I decide if I want to carry on with Planet Zoo or I have been getting the, uh, the the satisfactory itch again. I can't. Wait, wait. Final Fantasy fifteen. wasn't one that was on my radar. <laughs> but... I know. I'm so looking forward to that stone. I think it's going to be really cool. Um, why Final Fantasy 15? My Final Fantasy is experiences 11 and 14 and that's it. And I, I, I br briefly tried 10 something, 10 X2 or something, and I fucking hated it. I'm, I'm not one to uh, force myself to play old games with mean mechanics. The really Sega games. I've I've heard that uh, Seven is the I don't know. Like everyone seems to talk about Seven the mostest but no I mean like so I've got a list of games in discord um 
and I, I was kind of like meaning to sort of go to there, but I mean, yeah. Is that a, a tidy enough seam, do you think? Right, now we have to tighten, tighten up this one. This was a pain in the butt. I started making this in Jan uh, February last year because I wanted uh, a light caddy to wear in summer or autumn, whatever. And <laughs> when I started making it, there was a lot less of me. So I don't even know if this is going to fit. So that's a fun game. Yeah, no, I need to be able to get up and pee. If I, if I gotta pee, I need to be able to pee. I'm an old lady now, Stone. I have a Walmart bladder. And you know I don't have a, a leather seat cover. No, it's a janky piece of shit that leaks. My chair is is not uh, made for liquidy accident. But no, so I started doing what I was thinking of is I started doing my trailer park zoo last night because I finished those scenarios. So that's as an option, and then of course No Man's Sky because they had the update this week. Um, and so there's that, and then there's just like the other games in the list that I haven't got to in a while, or Satisfactory. Like I still haven't finished Mass Effect. I'm in Mass Effect Two right now. I had to take a break from that because everyone was just telling me what to do and it was really fucking me off. Did not enjoy that. You all know how much I love backseating. It's my favorite. Oh, man, do I do it on that side as well? It's true. It's true. It's really annoying. Who needs front seats when you can have back seats? Alright, so... Um, oh, you're still attached! <laughs> okay. So, 
it's starting to look like an item of clothing. Like it. <laughs> there is no fucking way this is gonna fit around my fat existence. <laughs> no chance. A chance. Ooh, yes, that'll help. <laughs> Just make me eat more candy. Then my clothes will that don't fit will fit better. Thanks, Star. We have a pineapple gummy. Um, side side stitches now. Maybe I'll, I'll sell it. Oh, am I supposed to weave in these bits? Weave ins, yes. I think I, th I think I've run out of go. <laughs> I think I've run out of oomph for this one for now, for today. I'm just like, oh, it's going to take so much messing around. I don't even know if it's going to fit. Um, and then it's it's like it's late so yeah let's um we, we let's adjourn this um who who's on oh it quiet uh Okay, let's see who's on in makers in the makers category. Maybe we can find a new person. Yeah. Okay, well the one person I was thinking about rating in the makers category is signing off, so that's helpful. Does anyone does, does anyone have a suggestion for a raid target? Because I just brain my brain just is just like noped out. First person to to make a suggestion, I'll just raid them. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. All I can think about is my burger. She's ending though. Like they're they're on their stream ending scene. So that's who I was thinking of. No, he's finished. 
I'm gonna go raid him with my sandwich. Look, you're not helping. Yeah. Norris, Norris is big help. All right. I'll do it myself then. All right, we're gonna raid uh, Divine Pathways. They are weaving on a loom, I think. Uh. Oh, did. <laughs> was it was it me, Luke? Was it me? <laughs> um. I funny that okay yes this is they are they the weaving I'm pretty sure they're weaving on a loom uh making fabric it is an 18 plus stream uh specifically labeled 18 plus uh 420 friendly make of that what you will um I will be back on Wednesday with something I don't know what yet. We'll see. I don't know what I feel like. Um, I may be looking around Discord tomorrow, possibly watching weird zero killer shows on HBO or something. Uh, but yeah, other than that, I will catch you guys later. Have a good evening. Be safe. Be well. Be kind to yourselves. And uh, yeah, other words. What is, is that? A tardigrade? <laughs> I don't I don't even know what that is. Okay, anyway, <laughs> okay, bye.